Hello everybody, this is Out of the Box Unboxing and in today's episode um, I'm going to review for you this Ultimate Speed Battery Alternator Tester and it, this uh, this video it will be split in two parts first let's say some walk around I mean uh, unboxing which is <laughs> very simple and second I will move to two cars to test uh, the, um, the measurements one it will be uh, petrol, second it will, it will be a diesel uh, and we will see what it, what this uh, battery and alternator tester uh, can do so yeah let's do it uh, some basic parameters as you may see uh, for 6 and 12 volts car and motorcycle batteries and alternators blah 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 uh, this is a uh, quite interesting 80 centimeters of length per cable uh, others it's a marketing uh, stuff so what we have here mm, overload charging charging maximum okay fully charged half charge battery very very low I'm curious what is battery ver very low for for this uh, it's it's a plastic oh nice feature it has a magnet is it magnet yes it's it's magnet so it will help you I don't know to put it on 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 on, on the hood of your car and this is a rather small okay it's uh, also for motorcycle batteries but for usual cars I mean this might be a problem this this size it should be slightly bigger in my opinion uh, okay and what is the what is manual saying about um, minimum voltage that uh, battery has to have where we have an English, it should be on the beginning, but it's not. Is it in English at all? Blah, 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 blah. No, it isn't. Okay, so um, that is. It will be in the description below. Uh, but okay. 15, vo uh, 15 volts it's a maximum so it's overloaded mm. I will state it in the description what is the mm, frame of those voltage for those voltage um, when it's when it's running it should be okay but according to what I see, uh, now it's I, I, I cannot uh, okay for more details I will attach in the description the um, manual in the uh, the English version and for the time being thank you and see you uh, later
charge very low So we are back and um, uh, I hope uh, for you it's uh, useful this, this, this video but for me uh, this device is useless actually because if your car is working uh, you, you don't actually don't need to uh, check what is the um, voltage in your battery in your, in your car battery because uh, if it's okay you can hear uh, instantly that um, it's it's starting without any problems. If every if anything is is bad, your battery will get you it will uh, will uh, will let you know uh, straight away. So uh, for checking, for instance, um, alternator um, health. For me, it's, it's pointless because if it's dead, uh, soon after your battery is dead and you are getting in, in, into troubles straight away, and uh, I don't know, checking each day, um, uh, charging voltage, uh, is it okay, fully charged, half charged? I don't really get uh, um, uh, get reasonable um, justification for 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 such uh, device. It's a gadget. Maybe if you have, a, for instance, motorbike and you are not using it during um, winter time, you can check your battery condition. But as all motorcyclists know, during the winter, you almost uh, all the time need to charge your battery. So or, uh, or 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 start your motorcycle for for some period to 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 charge it. So actually, in my opinion. This device is pointless. It's a gadget, uh, and uh, in my opinion, is just uh, throwing away your your money. Uh, if your battery is dying, just buy a new battery, um, and for next two or three years, you should not have uh, problems uh, with battery at all. If alternator is it's it's gone, you need to replace it with with new one. So um, only. Uh, in those two cases, you need to. You need, you need to, on the end of the day, you need to invest your money in uh, in uh, repairing your either motorcycle or uh, car. So for me, it's 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 pointless. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the the test. Uh, you saw it. It was uh, with um, 1.2. Oh, just for your information, the first motor it was uh, 1.2. Uh, petrol uh, second it was 1.6 diesel engine and uh, of course <laughs> you, you could distinguish by uh, by hearing the, the, the sound of, of diesel which w which was uh, significantly um, louder okay thank you for watching stay tuned and see you next time bye